Version 0.038 is now live on all platforms. Let's take a look. It's mostly a massive control overhaul, but it also introduced the first few sound effects to the game for menu clicks, placement, and destruction. There's a nice new audio menu, though most of the sliders don't currently do anything. Along with the new controls, you can now customise them on the hotkey menu, which is great. The game now has a hotbar, and this is an awesome addition that I think it really needed, so that's fantastic. You can toggle it with H, and you can switch between four different hotbars with F1, 2, 3, and 4. Currently no mouse control to set items to the hotbar, so you have to hold shift and push a relevant number key. But selecting is as simple as clicking the item you want, or just pushing a number. There's now a pipette copy paste, so if you mouse over something and push C, it puts it on your cursor. Over the last couple of updates, the game switched over to a camera control system where right click is now the main camera control. This update cleans that up by taking everything else off right click. So because of that, the raise and lower tools are now two unique tools. You can actually toggle between them with tab though, so that's quite nice. And the same is true of the remove block or remove layer system. If you want to toggle on and off your logic blocks, you now have to hold control and left click, but you can also push enter while mousing over. If you want to pick up workers, you now have to use the move tool, which you can get by pushing M. This also allows you to pick up items off shoots and belts. On the subject of shoots, you now unlock those with the lumber mill rather than the workshop. You also unlock most of the scaffolds when you place your first lumber mill. Eric's fixed a bug with drag placing and deleting, so you shouldn't really get any holes when clicking and dragging now, so that's great. And last but not least, there's a couple of bug fixes and some changes to gold prices, which I won't list here. They are all in the full patch notes in the description. I'm partway through working on some Factory Town gameplay content, so you can subscribe if you'd like to see that when it's released. I have been Mug, your favourite award-winning video game nerd. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.